Minis and Maria George. I'm studying in 7th standard of Sacred Heart Convent Senior Secondary School, Singalam. In this video, I'm expressing a math trick that is very helpful in our studies. So, we can go to the video. So, our trick is that how can we take the square of any number that is greater than 10 and less than 100? So, our first number is 26 squared. In order to find the square of 26, we have to take the square of 6. That is 36. So, write 6 here and 3 is carry over. After that, we have to multiply these three digits for the next digit of the answer. 2 into 6, 12. 12 into 2, 24. 4 here, 2 carry over. After that, take the square of the 10th place digit. That is 2. Square of 2, that is 4. Write 4 here. Therefore, our final answer is 676. So, our next example is 23 square. First, we have to take the square of the ones place digit, that is 3. The square of 3, 9. Then multiply all these three digits, that is 2 into 3, 6. 6 into 2, 12. Write 2 here, then 1 carry over. After that, Take the square of 2, that is 4, write 4 here. So, our final answer is 529. So, we are moving to our next example, that is 12 square. In order to find the square of 12, we have to take the square of 2, right here. Then, multiply these three digits, that is 4. Then, take the square of the 10th place digit. That is 1. Final answer is 144. So, we are moving to our next example. That is 15 square. Taking the square of 5 and writing carry over. Then multiplying these three digits. Carry over. Then taking the square of 10 to place digit. Then, final answer is 225. Again, another example. 20 square. Here, taking the square of 0, write 0 here, then multiplying this digit, that is 0. Then, taking the square of the 10th place digit, that is 2. Uh, 2 square is Four. So, final answer is 400. So, we are moving to our next example. That is 18 square. So, first, take the square of 8. 64, 6 carry over. Then, multiply these three digits. 2 into 8, 16. 16 into 1, 16 itself. Write 6 here. 1 carry over. Then, take the square of 1. That is 1 itself. Final answer is 324. So, we are moving to our next example. That is 38 square. So, find the square of it. 64. 6 carry over. Multiply these three digits. That is 3 into 8, 24, 24 into 2, 48. 8 here, 4 carry over. Then take the square of 3, that is 9, right here. Then add the carryovers and write the final answer, that is 1,444. So, we are moving to our next example. That is 34 square. 
First, take the square of 4, right here, 1 carry over, then multiply these 3 digits, 2 into 4, 8, 8 into 3, 24, 4 here, 2 carry over, then take the square of 3, that is 9, right here, then add the carry overs, that is Therefore, a final answer is 1,156. So, we are moving to our next example. That is 33. 33 square. So, first take the square of 3. That is 9. Then multiply these 3 digits. 2 into 3 is 6. 6 into 3. 24. 4 here. 2 carry over. Then take the square of 3. That is 9. Right here. And take the final answer. So, a final answer is 1149. So, we are moving to our next example. That is 36 square. Take the square of 6. That is 36. 3 carry over. Then multiply these 3 digits. 2 into 6, 12. 12 into 3. 12 into 3. 36. 6 here. 3 carry over. Then take the square of 3. That's 9. So... A final answer is 1196. 1296. So, we are moving to our next example. That is 32 square. First, take the square of 2. That's 4. Then multiply these three digits. 3 into 2, 6. 6 into 2, 12. 1 carry over. Then square of 3, 9. So our final answer is 1024. So I think this video is clear for you. And it's very helpful. Thank you.